everyone, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. I'm Jen. Today's video is going to be an empty house tour. So me and Tom are going to be moving in the next month or so, hopefully, and I wanted to do an empty house tour to show you the house that we have bought. It is Tom's dad's old house. So I want to show you the house that we have bought. We do need to do quite a lot of jobs to it before we move in. But that is just fine because obviously the price that we paid, we're getting a really good deal. And I, me and Tom don't mind doing a good renovation project. So yeah, I'll take you to my house tour. Okay, so this is my living room. Me and Tom are so happy with the space. So I'll just move around so you can see a little bit better. But it is such a massive room. And this house is end of terrace and on this wall here we have absolutely no neighbour attached to us which is amazing. So yeah, so happy. I love the fireplace and I think we're going to try and put the TV right on top there. But yeah, I'm so happy. I love the colours. We are going to take the wallpaper off I think because we just want it like plain underneath. But to be honest, I'm not really bothered about that. But we also have two doors. So we have one door here and we also have another door here. And we'll probably end up closing this off at some point, but just obviously not the minute. And then that's the garden through there. So if I take you through to the garden, it is very overgrown. When we came a few months ago, it was all fine. But obviously because of the season and everything, a lot of weeds have grown. But this is going to get cleared out today. So we even have a little pond that's there. And yeah, oh, the garden is so nice. I, I like how we have a shed already. And this is going to be full of flowers once it's all cleared. And I just love our little fishies in the pond. So that is our garden. And we also have these sliding doors, which I think are fab. So I think the theme for the living room is going to obviously be gray, but we're gonna have a nice kind of oak wooden floor that we're going to do. And I think we're just gonna either have light gray all the way around or have like a nice dark gray feature wall here and then the rest of it light. And we did buy our sofas. So those will be about 14 weeks max, hopefully sooner, but those are also a nice light gray. So yeah, super excited about that. So that is the living room and garden. So you'll have to just ignore the bags on the floor because we are starting to do some renovations today. But we're going to focus on the kitchen now. So this is the kitchen. We have so much cupboard space and I think it is a really big size kitchen. So if I just do a quick pan for you, we are going to change the colour of the kitchen cupboards. And it is so hot today, hence why we've got the window open. But it is nice and cool in here. So... We are, it is a really nice big square kitchen. So I think we're going to have a dining table here. I see Tom's already started taking off the kitchen cupboard doors to obviously take off the little film that we've got on them because we want to paint them like a nice grey. And the blue walls, I think, are just going to go to a very either super pale grey or a nice white. This room is one of the darker rooms at the minute, but the shade is covering the house on this side. But yeah, this is a freezer, but we do need to get rid of it. It uh, just came with the house. And then we've got our doors. And yeah, I'm super excited. I love like the white tiles there. And yeah, so this is our kitchen. We just need to do quite a few renovations to it. Um, and obviously change all like the knobs and the taps and stuff. But yeah, so this is the kitchen. I'll show you very quickly. We just have the hallway here. And then that's that other door to the living room. And so we have a little big storage bit under there that we have like DIY stuff. And then we have the nice tiled floor. That is the front door, but I don't want to show you the front of the house just in case you never know who's watching. And this door here is actually our second bathroom. So this is our bathroom. We just need to pop that back on. Don't just ignore that. Um, and we need to get a light in here. But so we're going to change the red to a very nice white, I think. So we've got our sink and we have... A few little dolphin bits there. And then we have our toilet, which will be changed at some point because it is quite old-fashioned. But it still works and everything. So also have like this little storage bit here. So yeah, we have a very nice downstairs toilet. It's a really good size. We just need to obviously change a few bits. Then we obviously do need to put carpet on the stairs. 
because there's nothing on them at the minute. We did rip them up when we were kind of doing up the house a few months ago, so we do need to put new carpet there. So obviously we cannot let Millie, my dog, in here until that's obviously sorted because the spikes and stuff are still on there, especially. And I struggle to come up these stairs. But we have quite a few stairs and I love like this shiny wood here. So let's go upstairs. Okay, so in the hallway now, so this is our hallway and I'll show you all the rooms. I did forget to say this is a three bedroom. So we're going into the first bedroom. This is going to be at mine and Tom's bedroom. And this is what it looks like. It is really nice and long. We're gonna put the bed in the middle here, two bedside tables, and hopefully put a TV on this wall. We definitely do need to paint it. I'm thinking a very nice light gray. And we are going to take this up the floor again and have a nice wooden oak, I think. Or we might have a nice gray, we haven't decided yet. But I think this bedroom is going to be either very neutral or very neutral with touches of gray. So yeah, it is a super, super long bedroom. Loads of storage. I think we're gonna have like the wardrobe there with the drawers. And then I'm not quite sure for this side um, what to put here. Or we might just leave it plain. I think a nice rug as well might look nice in here. And then out the window, we just have overlooking the back garden. So yeah, this is going to be at mine and Tom's bedroom. And again, this is directly under the living room. So nobody's actually attached to us on either side of the wall because this is obviously another bedroom on this side, which is amazing. If so, if you have like slightly noisy neighbors, I know we don't, but that's always never going to be an issue to sleep and things because we're not actually attached to a neighbor on this bedroom or living room. So let's go through to the box room, which is in the middle where Tom is. So Tom's here. This is going to be his little gaming room. It is quite dark in here. It's got like this kind of nudie brown on the walls, but we are going to change it to like a nice navy. So it is just your standard box room. You can't really get much in here other than a single bed, but we're not gonna have that. We're gonna have a nice computer desk with Tom's gamey bits on. Tom is just filling the walls, <laughs> the little holes that we have. So yeah, that is the box room. There's not really much to say about box room. And then coming round, we have my room. So by my room, I mean the room that I'm gonna film all my YouTube videos in. So, just shut the door there and just do a quick pan for you. It is a really nice, good square bedroom. So yeah, this is what it looks like. So I'm going to take the wallpaper off and paint it. Either this wall or the other wall, I want to paint pink. Just a really nice pink so I can have my dressing room table propped up against and it's just a nice feature wall. So I'm gonna have one wall pink because I want a feature wall. I just wanna add a little bit of color to this room. I don't want it all white because I, when I film my videos, because my hair is so light, I don't want my hair to kind of disappear into the background. Um, I, I found that with like my current filming setup now, like depending on what kind of hair color my hair is. So pink, just a really nice neutrally pink, not like bright pink or, you know, neon pink, just a really nice subtle pink that I am gonna put the painting swatches on um, the wall today and decide which kind of pink I want. There he is. Oh, it's going to be my filming room slash beauty room. So excited. I really, really wanted a dressing room table. I'm finally gonna get one. I'm gonna get the one from Ikea. I'll put a little picture here. You probably know which one it is, but that's like the one I love. Like I just love that one. And then the other walls are just going to be a nice white color and um, just so it keeps the room nice and bright. And you know, I don't want my room full, full pink, fully pink. Um, because that's just not my kind of style. Yeah, so this is my filming room. So I'll leave in this room and then finally we have the bathroom. So this is what the bathroom looks like. It just needs a uh, clean of the tiles really. There's nothing wrong with this room at all. It's nice and bright. We just need to change the shower because there's nothing kind of attached there. Um, so we're gonna have a, like a whole new shower system-y thing. Um, the bath will be replaced at some point because it is quite old-fashioned, 
but we're happy with it for now. A bath is a bath. As long as I can put bath bombs in it, I'm not bothered. And then I like how we have this like little cabinet as well. So yeah, I'm super happy with this bathroom. I love the amount of light it gets in. It's very sunny today, so it looks super bright. Um, and we just need to replace the window at some point, but it's not number one on the list to do. So yeah, just a nice bathroom. So that was my empty house tour. I hope you enjoyed watching. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe down below. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.